Hi guys, it's that time again. It's the Fig Tree subscription box. This is box number one for the 22-23 subscription year. We will be getting four of these once every quarter. And this is the first one. It was supposed to ship in April, but because of natural you know, delays for what's going on in the world, it came a little late. But I'm really excited about this one because I think this one's going to have her new fabric line stitched, which I'm really, really anticipating um, enjoying. So let's go ahead and get in this and these are not my sewing scissors in case anybody wants to know they're my multi-purpose scissors so let's see here we go we have the little box of figs 2022 box one the spring box so it says, hello, my fig tree friends. Welcome to your first box for your 2022 subscription. We're so very glad you have joined us. This box is a really good one with a medley of spring and summer feeling items featuring our brand new stitched collection. Yes. Thanks for joining us for this year's little box adventure. So um, let's get the box out. Always make sure we search around. All right. Let's get that out of the way. And here we have our box. Let me organize myself here. We have some patterns. All right. So the main project is a tisket, a tasket. So it looks like this is the pattern. Look how cute those little baskets are. I was kind of a little bit worried when um, I saw the little teaser online where it said a tisket, a tasket. Um, <clears throat> just because I'm like, wow, that sounds like it's some kind of basket. So I hope it's not really, really complicated. But this looks pretty uh, simple and pretty basic, which is pretty much what I like to sew. I like to just kind of enjoy myself and do, you know, simpler blocks, especially because I'm not really advanced. So I love this. It says it takes one charm pack and a matching mini charm to make this to make this block. So here's a look at what you get or what you need. Um, the block sizes are four and a half by five inches finished. The quilt size is approximately 33 by 35 and a half. And um, looks like for backing um, and binding, we're going to need one and a quarter yards backing and three eighths yards small red print binding. And um, she often has finishing kits on her site for these. And I did order the finishing kit, so the backing and binding should be here soon. Super cute pattern. Can't wait to make that one. I like that one. So let's see what she has to say about that that we haven't already talked about. It's a basket themed wall hanging or a table topper as shown in the pattern. We are so happy with how these small and simple baskets showcase the pattern and the fabric both. Follow the pattern info for fabric placement. For this project you will be using one charm pack, one mini charm pack, ivory solid and the red print all provided in your box. So that is awesome. So that is item number one. Snippy socks. So it looks like we got a pair of socks. And let's see. Exclusive fig tree um, socks. I designed these fun socks as a part of our special sock club for Moda Fabrics. And the moment I finished working on them, I knew they needed to go into this exact box. Cool. Perfectly thematically. Wait. Thematic. Perfect themat thematically with our stitched collection, don't you think? And oh, so comfy as you sew your sewing pattern. So those are kind of nice. Very cute. Bye, Moda. So that is item number two. That's our fun notion. Soap escape. Oh, it looks like we have some soap. It looks like a bar soap here. Hmm. Let's read about it. It says, custom created quilt soaps. We are feeling extra effervescent about these goat milk based beauties. Oh, it's goat milk. Interesting. And you can kind of see, except for the um, reflection here, it's kind of got a quilt block on the front of it, which is pretty cool. 
They're beautiful to look at and display and even better to use. Made for us exclusively from the lovely folks at Soap Escape. The scents are beyond perfect. One soap is bergamot and the other is coconut citrus sorbet. You might just be looking for excuses to wash your hands with these little lovelies. Oh. I think mine might be, I don't know. I'm not sure. But it looks like there's probably a couple of little patterns maybe on there. Nope, this pattern isn't done here at all. Cool. So that's nice. That's the next little notion. We have, oh, our stickers. So two of those. Are they the same? Yeah, two of those. Oh, and two of them in the teal. So we got four stickers this month. I think might be putting, I don't know which one I'll put on the box. We'll see. So there's our stickers. Now we get to the good stuff, the fabric. So it looks like we have two mini charm packs. And I know that the main pattern said that it needed one. Oh, there goes my cat. Excuse us, Jasper. So we're going to use one for the main pattern. Drop my paper. One charm pack, one mini charm, ivory solid, and the red print. So here is our charm pack, and this is the new stitched fabric. I'm so excited about this. I saw it online when it was just kind of brand new announced, and I loved it so well, I did order a fat quarter bundle. Look how cute that one is, right? There's a text in here. Come on. It says stitched, 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 stitched. I do love my text prints. Oh, that's going to be a nice one. That would be a nice background. Oh, that's pretty. There's some little blocks here. Oh, uh, come on. Oh, that's cute too. And it looks like they're going to repeating some different colors. Oh, look at that nice big print. We have some green. So we're kind of just repeating prints, but in a different colorway. Oh, I love the yellow in here. The yellow gives such a nice buttery pop. And we have it in that sort of a uh, fig tree red, that rhubarb -y sort of red, scarlety sort of red. There's another print hiding in here. Love, love, love this minty teal. Really, really excited about that. So that's the um, charm pack that goes for the pattern. And then let's see what other fabric we have here. So it says that a red print, so this will be the red print. Oh, and I just dropped my paper. And I just dropped that, so excuse me. Boy, I'm just not doing a good job today, am I? So here's the red print. Super cute. I really like it. And that should be, I believe, probably the binding. Here we have, well, this feels like more of a canvas -y, so this probably goes for project number two. We have this, which also probably goes for project number two. Here is the ivory solid. So here's the ivory solid, the red print, so background and binding. And then this will make your baskets for the Tisket Tasket uh, pattern. And then we have, let's see, project number two, the extra project, is a customized canvas bag based on everyday zips pattern provided. 
So you'll have a canvas, zipper, and one mini charm pack. So let's see, is there a picture of it? Oh, here it is. So we're gonna be making this. This is um, these little zips, little zipper pouches. Aren't they cute? Super cute. So I guess you kind of just pick which one you want to make. Or maybe mix them all. There's your materials list. So that is super cute. And then what we have for that is we have the canvas and then this fabric, the other mini charm pack for stitch, and a, a zipper. So we have all the materials we need to make the extra secondary project. So there's a lot of stuff in here, really good directions too. So not only do we get that pattern, but there's this whole set of extra directions that you get with it as well. So that's kind of nice. And so that was our fig tree box this time. Let's see, anything else we need to talk about? It says sewing machine zipper pull. Did I miss something? Oh, I did. This goes with the pouch. It's a little sewing machine zipper pull. Oh, that's cool. So you'll put that on whichever one of the pouches you make. You have a little sewing machine zipper pull for it too. So it's actually a full, complete um, secondary pattern. So that's what we got in our fig tree box for the first box of um, 2022. And actually, as a bonus, I'll show you my fat quarter bundle, which I also got in the mail today. Really fun box. Thank you, Joanna Figueroa from Fig Tree. I'm going to open this really quick for you, too. I kind of couldn't tell just from the pictures um, that I was going to really love the stitched line. And when you order a bundle from Fit Tree from their website, they give you a free pattern. So here's my free pattern that I got, which is star crossed. Look how cute that pattern is. Super fun. Can't wait to make this. And here is the fat quarter bundle. from the stitched line and you can kind of see all the different it's like a it's going to be like a more of a brown it's usually she has like a dark a lighter taupe like which is in here but this one has a little bit of a darker brown taupe we have some ivory a little bit of green loving the yellow in there it's just a really nice pop there we have this um lovely kind of rhubarb -y sort of red a little bit of uh, white with the red in there and then look at that nice um, light teal. So I think this is going to be so fun to work with and to make a quilt with. And I'm really excited to have that. And with my free pattern that it came with. So until next time, we will see you guys and enjoy uh, your quilting, cross stitching, crocheting, whatever it is that your hobby is.